Good morning everyone and welcome back to the channel. Today we will be continuing from where we left off by beginning the prelude, Rise of the Emperor. So, here we go with a presence on Sios, the Chapter 5 Epilogue. going on? Where are you? Commander, I have need of you. Our former Emperor, Vishyad, he's... I don't care what they tell you. Assume they're lying and deal with them. He's here. Vishyad's presence. Here on Zyost. He's taking over this outpost, controlling soldiers and Sith, using them to murder anyone he can. Hold them off. I'm on my way. Good. Thank you. I'm sending coordinates. We'll hold this bunker as long as we can, but you must hurry or... Lana, can you read me? Lana? Zios. Imperial military forces on Sias have ceased responding to orbital comm signals. Reports indicate the military has turned on the civilian populace. An Imperial military outpost may yield more information. A transport is available for departure. Apparently going to be laggy today. Come on now. Apparently we are expecting a storm today, so with any luck the lag will cease, but I won't make any guarantees.
Lana. Hey there. I had foreseen your arrival, but I didn't believe it. I thought, after bearing witness to my rebirth on the Yavin Moon, why? Why would you stand in the face of certain death? And then I realized you're a simple one. Not terribly bright, but that's fine. I'm rather pleased you're Insulting here. my intelligence is not You'll smart. You'll bear witness to a world's end if you survive long enough. He's gone. I can... I can find him. No oh, good. More possessed troopers. More of you already. I suppose I should be flattered. So you've arrived. Good. There's much to be done. Always nice to see a friendly face. I've missed you. I'm trying to avert a mass catastrophe while keeping the most powerful mind in the galaxy out of my head. I, I can't think about that. The Jedi you fought belong to the Sixth Line. SIS commandos who follow their own addendum to the Jedi Code, hence the name. There is no contemplation. There is only duty. A great point of view, so long as they're working for you. Pardon the interruption. I sent a probe droid to look into that crash shuttle, Minister Benico. It's empty. Minister Benico? Yes, well, I was never a fan of titles. I'm afraid this one's going to stick. Commander, it's a distinct honor. This is Agent Rain Kovach. He's been something of a rising star in Sith intelligence here on Zyles. I've not heard much of anything about the new organization. I'd like to know how things are coming along. Nothing we've done will matter if we don't address what's happening now. As you've witnessed, Vishit is taking hold of an increasing number of soldiers and Sith. His goal continues to be the accumulation of power. Agent. The dark side is strong on Zyost. Using the outpost's resources, our former Emperor can massacre the defenseless to fuel him. The more powerful he becomes, the more people he can control. He will keep on killing until nothing's left. Yes, I'm on my way. I need it everywhere, all at once. I've already lingered too long. Agent Kovac has a plan to help stem the bloodshed. I'll get right to it, Commander. The outpost armory is wide open right now. It's where the possessed have been getting their firepower. It needs to be placed on lockdown. That won't be enough to stop him. No, it won't. But we have to start somewhere. I'll go out ahead. Your eyes and ears. The more we kill, the more it fuels the Emperor, so my stealth tactics are, of course, more important here than ever. Not that it'll affect the story, of course, but, you know. We'll start by taking out the Quartermaster, and then we'll thin out the ranks beyond that. Take 
this suddenly. You sure create a path out there. That's good. But hey, it's bad too. Each time a pawn is killed, Vitiate gets a little bit stronger. Not as much as when they kill, but well, that's what Minister Benico says anyway. So, we have to stop them without killing them. Or we destroy Vitiate. Not that anyone seems to know how to do that. there. Master Soro. Sixth Line Commander. I like this one. Strong-willed. Not that it will save her. Or anyone on this world. You do know I'm just the help, yes? I'm not the one you should be coming after. Caution. Good. I had begun to think you might not have any sense whatsoever. Not that it will save you. When this world turns to red, and you choke on torrents of blood, remember that this was your chance to flee. A chance I... gave! There is no... contemplation. There is only... duty. We're wasting time here. The armory's safe. You go ahead. I'll be close behind. <laughs> All right, now we have to connect to the anti-air guns. Which, unfortunately, is easier said than done. And I really hate having to manipulate the camera angles so much. And of course this spot won't be adequate enough for what I have to do. I was hoping not to have to kill anyone, but... Chances are I may actually have to. one of the five. Alright, this angle's good enough that it'll get us two of them. Now we just need to get the other three. at the right angle for the others. No.
Not sure if I'll be able to get the fifth one from this angle or if I'm going to have to move out some. Oh, nope, we can scan it from here. Alright, now we have to get to the administration office. I was waiting for that droid to break my stealth, but luckily it didn't happen. I can confirm it. The defenses are down. Between those weapons and the armory, a lot of the killing power is out of their hands now. Should be able to start evacuation efforts as well. The fewer potential targets on Zyast, the better. Sith intelligence hard at work, I see. Yeah, you. Don't take another step. I'm warning you. Take it easy, Commander. You know why I'm here. You know this person? Theron Shan. Yes, I yes. Really? If you came here to save your sixth line, you're too late. I don't know what you could have been thinking. All you've done is give Vishit more fuel for his fire. Second guess me all you want, but that's not gonna help us stop it. Oh, so you have a plan. A plan? A plan would be great, but no. Unfortunately, I don't know how to stop the most powerful being in the galaxy. I do know we have to try something. That's about it. The way things are out there, I can't believe I even made it this far. As soon as I crash landed, the Emperor's puppets started coming from my shuttle, just like that. Maybe figured on some easy kills inside. But the only thing I could think of, rig the ship to overload, fry everything in and around it. Tried to shield myself, but still scrambled half my implants. And that stopped the attack? They went down, yeah. Some of them got back up, but they seemed out of it. Not possessed, dazed. Intrusion! Vitiate's pawns! I have a thought. Be ready for anything. That was a... a nightmare? What? Who... who are you people? What's going on here? Just trying out a little experiment. You did great. Is that really necessary? They'd eventually become possessed again. You got a point, I guess. So now we know. Shock them unconscious and the tie is severed. For a while, at least. Get enough of them hard enough and they'll be out for a good long while. Yeah, but how do we do that? I, I have some ideas. I need to consult the new Adasta municipal systems. You gonna need a hand with that? Some backup? No. I'll be in touch. Oh, he seems confident. Is he any good? Lana vouches for him. Lana Benico, Minister of Sith Intelligence. Who'd have thought it, right? When I met her on Manon, she was in over her head. Seemed to be. She's come a long way since then. Yeah, I suppose you're right. I mean, what do I know? I should never have sent my team here. I made a bad situation worse than now, and now mm -hmm. I've got a priority holocaust. Great. You've been busy, Agent Sean. Chancellor. An off-the-books mission to Zyost. A secret team of Jedi that... I don't even know where to start with you about them. Everything's happened so fast, you don't realize... No, I do realize. I realize that you declined to inform me of a prime opportunity to cripple the Empire and face the Emperor head-on. We're taking advantage of the chaos on Zyost, starting with New Adasta. I expect your cooperation. Wait, 
please, before you send the order. You don't seem to understand, Agent Sean. There's nothing to argue. Our ships are in orbit. Your Supreme Chancellor is an idiot. Has already begun. And now she's just provided more fuel to the fire for Vishian. The Republic at its finest. Your current mission objective is located at the central district of New Adasta. A transport is ready for departure. Suresh has our forces all over New Adasta. Some of them are possessed now. In a real mess. You talking about her now, or you? Let's keep <laughs> on target. Doesn't matter how bad things get, we have to put an end to Vitiate's plan. Well, it wouldn't have gotten any worse if it wasn't for you and your idiots, so the blame lies squarely with you. This is Lana. Agent Kovac may have been hurt, possibly worse. I haven't heard from him and his track is off. That's unfortunate for him, isn't it? Bender the Victorious. Interesting name. about to say not walking through that don't be stupid going to say they're in front of the substation so it really doesn't matter. substation so that would be why. The So I actually didn't even have to fight those robots.
I tried to reach you to tell you this won't end well. The time for hand wringing ended when you shut down the Orbital Defense Command Center, Agent. With respect, you haven't seen what I have on the ground. The power the Emperor holds. I'm aware, Agent. Now, if you have a report on Sith Intelligence or the SIS, we can talk. But you will not tell me how to fight a war. Big mistake, my friend. Damn. This is bad. You have no idea. That is one way of putting it. I take it you heard all that. Or enough of it. You pretend to work for Lana. I'm assuming the same relationship with Theron. So that makes three masters. Do you even know which one you really work for anymore? If we don't put a stop to Vitiate, none of that matters. I know I've made things worse. More innocents are dying because of me, and that's... Please, let me help you. This isn't over. No. No, I wouldn't think so. down the dampeners. Okay, I've placed the dampeners on manual. I'll be controlling them while you alter the makeup of the grid once it's all set. We'll put a shock into every living thing in New Adasta. Then, we'll figure out what's next. Oh, I already know what's next. You should just be prepared. From Agent Kovach. He says you're working together on a solution. More and more of our forces have fallen to Vitiate. It's spreading beyond the city now, along with the wall. There must be an end to this. Excuse me. My attention is needed elsewhere. Everywhere. Okay, that's enough. Any more, and it's the dampeners that will take the brunt of the surge. All that's left is to disable the system failsafe.
Maybe you don't want to hear this. I have to say it, though. I respect Lona Benico sincerely. But the Empire enslaves and slaughters innocent people every day. And I respect common decency more. I hope you understand. <laughs> You'll find out. <laughs> I'll be taking your battery to overload the door. We've been calling them monoliths. I promise I wasn't eavesdropping. Just wanted to warn you. We've seen several of those creatures appearing throughout New Adasta. They're made from Sith alchemy, a sign of Vitiate's growing power. Extremely strong, next to impossible to kill. The one you just defeated is the smallest we've come across. I think you were eavesdropping. I think you can't stop thinking about me. I would hope you're joking, except this is hardly the time for it. And by the way, do look behind you. If you don't get out of my range so I can do what I need to do. And yes, that surge did actually kill it this time. Plan's over. Scrapped. Some giant thing tore through a junction. Caused an electrical surge. Dampeners are shot. You expect me to take your word for it? What's your angle, Kovac? I want this nightmare to end. That's my angle. Agent report. It won't work, Minister. I failed. Yes, you did fail. And for the last time. Agent Kovac was a valued asset. And you're a fool. Your incompetence allowed the Republic to place a spy right under your nose. He was working for Suresh. I... but... I... no... no, how could I have been so blind? Lana, we still have a problem to solve. Yes, of course. And I may have found a solution. I doubt you'll like it. I'm listening. War has broken out across the globe. Our former Emperor, however, has limited his involvement to the area around New Adasta, near you. I don't think it's a coincidence. It's possible he isn't as strong as he's been letting on. It's possible he's worried about what you could do. That's because he knows I don't give up. Good. I need you to maintain that confidence for what's to come. You must get all of his pawns, every last soldier, Jedi and Sith, to stop their slaughter and chase you into the heart of New Adasta. You must make Vishyad want to kill you now. Hmm, it's 
never a hard thing for me to make want people want to kill me. Your current mission objective is located at the People's Tower in New Adasta. A transport is ready for departure. Travel to the People's Tower. Ugly. Now we have to gain access to the upper level where the data center is. And in order to do that, we have to go through here. we had to blow it open. Come on out, I'll show you my gun. Gotta grab the weapon first. Now we blow open the door. Neil, I didn't exactly mean to blow myself up, but it is what it is. And at least we can die. We got a better belt. 
At least this one won't look so out of place with the rest of the armor, as the other one did. with the camera again. No, shoot. That was dumb. And now, of course, we're in combat, and I can't heal. Well, yes, I can. I have healing abilities. What am I talking about? again. Before we go ahead with this, you and I should talk in person. I'll see you shortly. <laughs> it's always good when she says we need to talk in person. You've made it, good. Time is short, so is reliable assistance. As Agent Kovach is no longer in the picture, I've taken the liberty of reaching out to someone I hope we can trust a little bit better. Hmm. Are you in position? Yeah, but this setup isn't anything like what you described. So what you're saying is you can't figure it out? Don't get all... I'll figure it out. We're about to begin, so that would be nice. What exactly are we about to begin, Nana? You're going to make Fisher angry. So angry that he'll place all his attention on killing you. When the time comes, you'll lead him to an electrostatic weapon stored here, in the heart of New Adasta. It's meant to be a last resort against major civil uprisings, but Theron's modifying it to be non-lethal. With the reduced charge, its radius of impact will diminish. Fine. Let's get started. Yes, let's. something. A large weapon here in the middle of everything. I'm going to use it to destroy you. A 
little on the nose, don't you think? We did want his attention. I have to go now. There's much to be done. Too much. I shouldn't have come here, truth be told. There's nothing wrong with wanting to see someone you've missed. Especially in times like these. If all this ever ends, maybe then. Now we need to go meet Theron on the top floor. previous chat with her, believe it or not. Look, I know saving the lives of Jedi isn't high on your priority list. The sixth line, though, they're... They're here because of me. You can find some way, any way at all. Just... Please help them. Don't do the other thing. You think I don't know what you're doing? Of course I know. I know everything. Sad little spy. And I will enjoy watching you fail. You say so. Let them live, they will just keep murdering in my name. Don't hesitate. Kill them. <laughs> I won't mind. And neither will your Republic friend. Don't care if he does. That's it. Got to suffer as big a non-lethal burst as we can manage. Should be enough to zap anyone in range into a nice, long, involuntary nap. Should be. Hard to come up with a one-size-fits-all solution. A lot of guesswork involved. Wish there was some way we could do a test run. They've got to be closing in. Then come on, we need to be shielded. Good and close. Two 
Two more of your team are dead, by the way. You have yourself to thank for that. Damn it. I hope there might be a way to save them, help them somehow. Everyone mm. gone and made a mess of things. Mm -hmm. Yes, you have. Here they come. Sure hope this works. Closest, took the biggest hit. Still alive. We did it. Yay. Let's just hope we got all of them. We should call Lana now, see if she has a plan for what's next. I have a better idea. Master Suro. No. Watching you believe you have a chance. It's amused me. Now, this whole charade is pathetic. Now, how do you wish to die? In combat? Or on your knees? Go away, little sip. This has nothing to do with your friends. This is you and I. All right, Emperor. Let's get this over with. I saw it. I saw everything. Every life. Every life he took. I took. It's all I can see anymore. I'm a monster. It's not true. You'll be okay. I'll take you to Tython. The Jedi will help you restore your mind and make you whole again. And then she'll be no good to us. We need to understand the connection Bishop established with this Jedi so we can stop it or exploit it. Yeah, and let me guess, the process is invasive. Hasn't she been through enough? We've bought ourselves some time, that's all. We can't risk the fate of the galaxy just to assuage your guilt. You want to take her brain apart, and you don't even know if you'll find anything. We have to try. He's never leaving. I'm going to hear him forever. Lana, you take her. What? You've got to be kidding me. I don't even know what to say to you. This is your mess now. I'm... I'm gone. I'll see that she's taken somewhere secure. You know, Vishad gave up on trying to take control of me some time ago. Perhaps he's not as powerful as we were led to believe. Still, he is more than formidable. We've only stopped him temporarily, and war still rages. We have much to do. I just ended a holo call with Darth Maul. He would very much like to speak with you. Of course he would.
the Darth Maul. You wanted a word. I couldn't make that out. Could you repeat? I'm curious. Do you really believe you've accomplished anything here? What do you think you've stopped on? Power-hungry maniacs can't be left to just do whatever they want. Noble. Pointless, but noble. I have decided that life is more interesting with you in it. If you wish to keep railing against me, then so be it. Your interference changes nothing. When I am finished here, when every life on this world has been exhausted, I want you to be alive, to know that I succeeded. How kind Goodbye. of you. And now all we have to do is witness the Emperor's final move here on Zyost. The end of it all. Sensors indicate high energy readings from the surface of Zyost. No further readings have been available since the event. Now we have to go down and look at the planet ourselves since the monitor can tell us nothing else. You notice a warning that orbital sensors detect a planetary anomaly. A widespread crisis may be imminent. If you choose to investigate, further travel to Zyos surface may become impossible, leaving any open concerns there unresolved. So, we're going to investigate the crisis. Because I don't care about the side missions that we didn't do, because we don't need them. is the end of an entire planet. As Vigiate devours all life on the planet, including the planet's life itself. entire planet wiped out in an instant. <laughs> All those lives sacrificed because of the stupidity of those in power. It was an Imperial world, so Imperial casualties weren't um, avoidable. But I'm talking about all the Republic casualties. From Theron's SIS Jedi to the forces Suresh stupidly sent. I take it you've heard about Zyos. I saw it for myself. It was a blur. We tried to evacuate as many as we could. Considering so much was out of control, I'd say we did all right. Mm, not sure the ones who are dead would agree. But Vitiate is stronger now. Sith intelligence is in complete disarray. 
It's all coming apart. It's a setback to be sure, but this isn't over. Not even close. When Darth Arcus first asked for my counsel, I considered turning him down. I wanted understanding, not a place in the power structure. But that's where I am. I don't take the responsibility lightly. Whatever comes my way, I will deal with it. I've seen what you're capable of. I know you won't disappoint. Thank you, Commander. Especially after Zyles. Putting an end to Vichit's threat feels like an impossible task. I don't believe it truly is impossible. Even if it were, we have to try. Is that optimism? It would appear so. Imagine that. Well, a Republic are licking their wounds, same as us. They aren't relenting. And they're hardly our only concern. I suppose I should go about looking after the security of the Sith Empire. Unless there was anything else. Anything you need, Lana. Anything at all. Anything I need? That will do for now. Be well, my love. All's well that ends well, or so they say. <clears throat> we need to return to Syost, however. Because this quest doesn't officially end until we go down to the planet's surface and see the destruction for ourselves. Make note of a warning that planetary traffic control stations are unresponsive. However, orbital sensors report that Zayas atmosphere remains within acceptable levels. Transport is available for departure to designated landing zone. Includes the end of it all. And as you can see, the planet is more or less lifeless. Alright, and that is where we are going to conclude for today, because when we reconvene, we will be using the ship's mission terminal to begin the prelude of Knights of the Fallen Empire, Chapter 6 of our story and the next expansion where we will get our first look at the new empire rising in wild space known as the eternal empire so thank you for joining me for today's video I hope that you enjoyed it if you haven't already please make sure that you hit the notification bell so that you don't miss what's coming next and if you did enjoy today's video please like and subscribe it really helps out, and I greatly appreciate it. Thanks everyone, and I'll see you in the next one.